Crazy Mike, crazymikesapps.com, with an iPhone app demo for Evertales by Crescent Moon Games in conjunction with Thunder Gameworks. This application is iOS Universal, works on the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad, and is in the games category, currently selling for $1.99. But hold the presses, this application will be free 12 13 11 through appventcalendar.com and Blacksmith Games. Yes, totally free for one day, 12 13. In fact, if you're lucky, you'll find it free tonight, 12 12, after 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Again, to download this or get it for free, go to appventcalendar.com or check iTunes after 11 p.m. tonight, if not tomorrow morning. Let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay of this zany medieval side-scroller that has awesome graphics, epic boss battles, and three customizable playable characters. I'm in the Salty Sea chapter currently. There are quite a few levels. I could play as Sir Jorgen, Arwick, the elf, or I could play as Taragorn. Let's go ahead and play here. You can upgrade their, abil their weapons and so on, as well as their character, and I'll show you that in a moment. I'm playing as Taragorn, but we're going to switch to the elf, and we're also going to switch to his sword, because he's not great at up-close combat unless he has his sword. He is great at jumping, and you'll see that each character has their own special abilities, and you will need each character throughout the gameplay. Again, you want to jump over the, the, the different obstacles, take out the enemy, always climb up or go up wherever you can because there are coins to be collected. And you want to get those coins because if you collect them, you can use them to power up or upgrade your character's weapons as well as your character overall into some funny, different, well, you'll see what I'm talking about in a moment. Again, the elf is not the greatest at close combat. The fighter is the magician or mage is good at certain things make sure you always get the chest as much as you can again double tap here for the jump break the boxes open that was health that I got it was a big beating heart fun stuff this is a cool part of the game I actually really can just dig the graphics here as you see you gotta dodge the cannonballs while collecting the gold while traversing the open seas here, which just graphically is extremely nice, as you can see. Watch out for the cannonballs. Whoop, took one there. Take too many, and you're going to have to start over from where you were at, as you can see. No, you can't see, because I'm going to stay alive, hopefully. Shouldn't open my mouth too quick. Again, the more coins you can collect, the better. Now, we can switch here as... Well, we can't switch, because I just got taken out. But I'll show you, you can switch here as the mage or the wizard here. And he does great at floating, so he's a good character to use during this water traversing part, as you can see. Because he can jump up and float over those cannonballs nicely and prevent any damage. We'll switch at the very end. Well, let's just switch now to Sir Jorgen, who is the fighter. Whoops, he's not as quick because he's kind of heavy. But he is a brute, and he does a great job of hacking and slashing the pirates that are currently the enemies at hand. Oh, going to switch to the elf because you have a nasty shark you want to jump over. Switch back to Sir Jorgen, and that is how you play Evertales with the multiple character ability. Pretty cool. I like it. Whoops, but you don't want to fall in the drink because if you fall in the water, well, you got to start over from where your last checkpoint was. In this case, we got to go back through the ocean and watch the cannonballs. Let's go ahead and jump out of here and go to the main menu and let me show you some of the upgradable items that you can upgrade such as the weapons as well as the characters themselves. Tap out here. Ah, actually let's go back into the book. And once you go back into the book, again, we'll begin in the chapter. When you begin a chapter, you get the opportunity to upgrade weapons. In this case, I have a longsword. That's not upgradable, but I can switch to a dagger. I only have 325 gold pieces, so that's not going to be upgradable. 700, again, oil flask, and so on. Now I can switch to the Arwick the Elf, and he has a longbow, which is upgradable. Again, you can scroll through here and see the different weapons. Now, they also have different characters. The Ninja, Silent Deadly, Socially Awkward. And you have Kiss the Royal Boot of Smackdown, the Prince. And again, you can go through here, the Convict. They got some really funny characters. I thought there was a Christmas Elf, which there is. And then, again, Targorn has his own upgradable characters as well. And so does 
Sir Jorgen, Spartan, Gladiator, and whatnot. Again, that is Evertales. Play as all three of these characters throughout the game as you need them. You will need all of them. I'll give you a hint now. Again, grab this app while you can. It will be free, 1213, through appventcalendar.com, or check iTunes. Until next time, this is Crazy Mike saying see ya. Yeah.